All right, uh, my name's Anthony Bantoft. Here today cooking two dishes. Uh, one is a Wagyu beef tartare with a truffle buttered crostini, uh, topped with a quail egg and a cognac yolk. Um, we've started today, we've got a little bit of truffle butter here that we're just smearing on a little bit of sliced bread just cut with a, with a disc, cut into a disc, uh, and then just bake till it's golden brown in the oven. Uh, we have one here. I have a little bit of chopped up Wagyu beef here. We've used tenderloin today. Um, so we're just going to dress that with a little bit of olive oil, a little bit of cognac, some quail yolk for a bit of shine, uh, some sea salt, a little bit of tarragon mustard for a bit of bite, uh, and then a little bit of chopped capers and a little bit of chopped shallot, just to give that little bit of a uh, little bit of tang and a little bit of crunchy texture to the to the meat. Uh, I've just added a little bit of olive oil. Uh, this is a little olive oil from Ibiza. Uh, we just came back, back up from there. Uh, working on the yachts, you know, you get to move around a lot and uh, see different varieties and of oils, vinegars, all different kinds of produce. Um, so I've got the beef there. I've added a little bit of oil. I'm going to season it with a little bit of sea salt. That's just a molden sea salt. You could use Himalayan salt, any kind of salt. Just a good quality salt is good. Uh, so I've thrown a little bit of the, the salt in there. I've got some chopped capers here. I prefer to use the baby capers, uh, not so much the large ones. They seem to just go down a little bit better, not as salty and not as bitter. Uh, so I've got some chopped shallot, some chopped capers. I'm going to add that to the beef uh, that I've seasoned with the sea salt, a little bit of olive oil. So we're just going to throw that in there, give it a little mix around. I've, uh, I've got a yolk here, just a couple of quail yolks that I've had some very finely diced chopped red onion. A little bit of chopped chive and a little bit of cracked pepper. I'm going to add a little bit to the uh, to the wagyu beef mix, just to give the meat a little bit of a shine. I'm going to uh, add a little bit of cognac to that. Just a dash. Use a good. The better the cognac, obviously, the better the flavour. Just a dash. So to give that a little mix around. The capers and the uh, and the shallot seem to go really well. With uh, with any any sort of raw meat, with carpaccio, with with tartare, a little bit of pepper. We're going to add a little bit of tarragon mustard. Just a dash. You can add more if you like. You know, depending on on your taste, and give it a taste if you like to add more. Add more. So I'm going to give that a good good little mix around. I've got some uh, some separated quail yolks here. Uh, I've taken off the white, and uh, we're going to garnish garnish the beef tartare with with the quail yolk. I'm going to place some uh, little baby spinach leaves just on the plate, just raw, fresh. Adds a little bit of crunchy texture to the dish, uh, and it just helps with a little bit of colour as well. So we're going to place the crouton on the plate now. Just a little triangle pyramid on the plate with the spinach leaves. Place them however you like, if you like. Uh, the crouton on top of that. I'm going to place the disc or the stainless cutter, whatever you like to call it, on the plate just to keep the uh, the formation of the beef in uh, in perfect shape. I'm going to start placing the the beef into the into the cutter now. Like I said, I do a lot of degustation menus, so everything's quite petite. I'm just going to place it in there like so. Put as much as you like. Uh, you know, you could make it a main course if you really wanted to. Uh, but today we're just keeping everything quite small and uh, almost bite size, just so you can get through those large course menus. I've got the the quail yolk here that I just mixed the cognac with, the chive and the onion. I'm going to dress that around the side of the uh, the dish. It's just like so. It's been been seasoned with a little bit of salt some pepper and I put a little indentation on the top there for the for the raw quail yolk which is gonna which is gonna help you uh, just smooth the dish out and the blend of flavors so we're gonna place it on top like so and then we're gonna garnish it with a little bit of shallot you could garnish it with some tarragon as soon as you have the tarragon mustard in there if you like uh, we're going to keep it. We've got shallot in the mix, so we thought we'd run with shallot today. A little bit of cracked pepper. 
Could have put a little bit of olive oil on there too if you like. Again, good olive oil. You don't want to go using, you know, too, too simple and too, uh, too light of an olive oil. You want it quite rich, a lot of flavor. And that's, uh, that's pretty much it. So you got a beef, Wagyu beef tartare with a cognac quail yolk. Uh, it's been laid on a truffle crostini. It's been buttered with some truffle butter. It's just a piece of bread that's been baked in the oven till golden brown. Place there, wagyu on top of that. Uh, the quail yolk, just to add that smoothness texture to the beef. And uh, just dressed with the quail yolk, with the cognac, chive, a little bit of onion, and just a dash of olive oil, just to, just to spice it up a little bit. And there you have it. Smoking up, that's my way.